For more than five and a half million South Africans, the week starts with one paper that holds a remarkable story. A single daily sun undergoes a tremendous journey that will touch at least 17 lives every day. The last statement, of course, raises a few eyebrows. So we enlisted the services of an independent research house who recorded this journey. First, we met Tembi, an assistant at a local school. Walking towards her friend's house, she was called over by readers 2 and 3, both roadside mechanics. Eventually, we met her friend who was in the market for some party supplies for the coming Friday. Next came Mpo, gossip guru, followed by number 6, 7 and 8, a trio of whiskey connoisseurs, then fellow football enthusiast number 9 and 10. Number 11 was in a bit of a rush, but paused long enough to take in a few stories. 12 was a sports fanatic. 13 and 14 ran a spaza shop and scoured the specials for appliances. 15 was Tembi's sister, an avid reader and the penultimate of our unique readers. Our paper made one final trip back to 6, 7, 8 and 16 before ending its journey with number 17. The results were phenomenal, but the research house wanted to make sure, so they did it again and again. The journeys were of course slightly different, but the numbers consistent. More than anything, the findings illustrated how the Daily Sun has truly become more than just a regular paper. It showed us how, in reporting on the colorful strands of the South African fabric, we have become a part of it. We are the conduit for getting people together, a reason to talk, a common ground between friends, neighbors and family. Daily Sun reaches millions of people every single day, putting South African brands in the hearts and hands of consumers. It's more than Zanzi's daily paper. It is a way of life.